All right, Shalom. First off and foremost, as always, I want to say, Kaha Loyim La, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, Retakodash. Double honors being to the elder apostles of Great Millstone that do rule and teach well. And of course, a sincere Shalom to you, Akim, out there that's pushing his truth through his spirit, through the power, and through the name of Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, Retakodash. Okay, so this is going to be a uh, quick lesson, you know, going in about, you know, how, you know, about how, you know, uh, this word is out, you know, and uh, the cat's out the bag, okay? And, um, you know, hey, man, this, this truth has reached, you know, many platforms, you know, many sources, and, you know, there's, hey, everybody know about the Israelites, man, all right? Everyone knows, okay? The elites know, the wicked elites, you know, the average Joe knows, everybody knows, okay? So real quickly, and guess what? This is all prophecy, all right? And, excuse me, and Esau is is um is uh, trying to stop this truth, you know, but he can't, all right? Because this counsel is not of men, it's of Yahweh Bashar Shai, all right? And even then, if you try to come, come up against this truth, all right, it's not going to, you know, quench it, but it's going to make it, you know, um, more, uh, more and more powerful. All right. So we're quickly, you know, let's get this one right here. Let's go to the book of Baruch. This is the book of Baruch 2 and verse 30. And it says, For I knew that they would not hear me because it is a stiff-necked people. But in the land of their captivities, they shall remember themselves. All right. And guess what? Our, haven't we remembered ourselves? All right. Haven't we, you know, uh, 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 you know, you know, uh, uh, woken up and 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 begin to know uh, uh, who we are, okay. And that's starting off with you know the whole full elect. Now, of course, you have you know all the Israelites out here. You know that that know that know who they are as far as you know being an Israelite and you know what tribe they're from, you know, and and calling upon the names of Yahweh Shema Shai, you know. But ultimately, you know, the elect are are fully are fully going to come around, okay. And actually, let's keep going. In verse 31, it says, And it shall know that I am the Lord their God, for I will give them in, in heart and ears to hear, and they shall praise me in the land of their captivity, and think upon my name, and return from their and, and return from their stiff neck and from their wicked deeds, for they shall remember the way of their fathers, which sit before the Lord. Right, man. And we're doing that. Okay, we have, you know, came to this truth. The whispering power of Yahweh by Shmuel Shai, by way of the apostles and elders, you know, who, uh, who taught this truth and you know and put us on. Okay, we have came, come to this truth, you know, being rendered active. Okay, put off the old man. Okay, and put on the old, and put and put on the uh, the new man. Okay, the uh, the the new creature that that is in that is in Yahweh Shai. Okay, and we have you know uh, turned back from our old ways. You know our our sinful and wicked deeds. Okay, and you know, and, and came back to Yahweh Bashima Shah repented, okay, and, and become a, a, a new person, okay, being reborn, okay, having uh, um, having a pair of minds stirred up, okay, so us being, and, and this proves that we're the Israelites, okay, because you know, uh, the, uh, these small hatters, okay, you know, they're not waking up and saying that they're the, you know, uh, you know, the, uh, the uh the the uh, true people uh, you know uh, of God okay they're not waking up and saying oh that's us no man all right you have so called minorities saying this that they're the you know the uh the true people of the Most High okay day uh day in and day out man okay just that alone just that example alone proves that we're the true Israelites okay the true Jews if you will okay. The true uh, uh, children of right of Yahweh Shai, okay, 
And Esau is and Esau is scrambling. Okay, Esau is scared that we are waking up, man. Okay, the Great Awakening. All right, and he's trying to do everything in his power to quench his truth. All right, but you can't do nothing against the truth before it. Let's get that real quick. Oh, excuse me. Let me do this real quick. Let's see. Um, what's that? Um, oh, yep, right here. This uh Second Corinthians uh thirteen and verse eight, and it says it says, um, for we can do nothing against the truth, but for the truth. Okay, so it doesn't matter, you know, so, you know, you can say, you, so you can say anything about this truth if you want to, you know, you, you can try to come up against it and say, you know, oh, it's fake and, you know, it's, it's bad for you or this or that. But no, man, it's not going to work. Okay, because what did Yahweh Shai say? He said, the gates of hell should not prevail. Meaning what? Meaning that nothing is going to overthrow this truth because this is of Yahweh Shema Shai. Okay? So, so, so you can try to slander it and try to make it seem, you know, uh, uh, something that is not. But but all you're doing is, is giving it more, uh, uh, more light upon it. Okay? You are just, uh, uh, you know, uh, 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 um, shedding more light upon this truth. Okay? Because this truth, we're, we're, it, listen, it's out. The cat, the cat is out the bag, man. All right? The cat's out the bag. OK, and people, you know, are, are, are now being uh, uh, hip to this. You know, you got you got comedians finding about it. You got, you know, you got uh, uh, um, celebrities find out about it. OK, even though even though it, no, even though people have been, you know, hip to it for, you know, for, for a long time now. But now but now it, it, uh, uh, but now the truth but now this truth has reached, you know, uh, 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 more platforms, you know, uh, 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 ESPN. Okay, because Kyrie Irving, you know, you know, a uh, TMZ because of because of Kanye, you know, you know, uh, you know, things like that. Okay, and this proves that we're at the end. Okay, because what the Yahweh Shai say? Let's get this in Matthew twenty four. Okay. Matthew twenty four and verse fourteen it says, "And this gospel, okay, right, this gospel, the gospel of the kingdom, okay, the gospel that." That uh, uh uh that that is a uh, hundred percent truth, the gospel that you know uh, uh um that th that is bitter and sweet, okay, we're all like sushi, all right, straight straight no chaser, okay, because you know the, the uh, because the uh the the, uh, the, uh, the so called pastors in the churches, all right, these Christian churches are not going to tell you the truth, okay, they're not preaching the gospel, okay, it says in this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached. And all the world, okay, and all the world, okay, for a witness unto all nations, all right, and then shall the end come, right, man? So this gospel is being pushed everywhere, okay, Japan, okay, uh, 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 Canada, the UK, America, Mexico, Suriname, Africa, you name it, all right. And so much that the, the and so much that the gospel has 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 been pushed, you know, on 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 all you know social media platforms and and uh, outlets, okay. ESPN things of things of that nature. And it says, and then shall the end come, and it proves that we're in the end. We're clearly in the end, man. All right, we are clearly in the last days of the last days. All right, and Jake is waking up. Okay, now now of course. Now we know that you know certain groups don't have the hundred percent truth. You know some some groups teach different doctrines, but I'm gonna say this. But guess what? They're out there pre preaching 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 that they're uh, preaching that they're Israelites, all right? To Jake, okay? They're out there uh, pushing, you know, and 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 uh, and uh, telling you that they're uh, the uh, the true children of the Most High. Yeah, about Shmuel Shai, okay. Hey man, whether you believe it, whether you whether you believe it or not, the truth is out here, okay. And Esau can't do nothing about it, okay. But panic, okay. 
that's why that's why the persecution is coming. That's why he's going to come down unto us like a flood, at, you know, uh, as is written in our, in our in Rev 12 and verse 12. OK, actually, let me get that real quick. This is a, uh, uh, um, let me see. Yep, Revelation. 2. Yep, this is it. This is a uh, book of uh, Revelation twelve verse twelve, and it says, "Therefore rejoice ye heavens, and ye that dwell that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down unto you having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time." Oh, was that was no without? Oh man, wait, wait. Let me see. That's the one, that was the one that I wanted, but that was a good precept, you know, well, that was a good precept to the one I, I, I quoted, you know, but hey, this devil is going to come down, to, is the, this devil Esau, you know, uh, uh, you know, is, is going to come down unto us, all right, with, with great wrath because, you know, hey, because he know he, he have a, sh a short time, you know, because he know that he is losing because, because he knows that, you know, uh, 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 a, a transition is coming, okay? A transition of power, okay, and like I said earlier, he's going to do everything in his power to to, uh, to, uh, to uh, stop this truth. But guess what? He can't stop it. All right, it's impossible for him to stop it because why? Because it's privacy, okay. And the words of Yah by Shmuel Shai, all right, is, is is not going to uh, be empty. All right, there are you. The words of Yah by Shmuel Shai are not going to re are not going to return unto him void. Meaning what? Meaning that they're gonna come to pass all right everything the lord says is gonna go set in stone okay so this devil okay is, is, is gonna come down to us with uh with, with great wrath because he knows he has a short time all right and that great wrath man is hey man listen listen man that that wrath is gonna be is gonna be some some hardcore stuff man that's why you want to stay prayed up and stay on the lord's good side all right so that way you know you no know, on these last days you'll be protected Okay, uh, 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 you'll be, you know, delivered, you know, uh, uh, from the sword, which is Esau. Okay, just like King, just like King David prayed for, in Psalm seventeen and verse thirteen. All right, real quickly, let me get the other piece of that quoted. Calm down like a flood. Yep, here it is, Isaiah fifty nine and verse nineteen. It says, "So shall they fear the name of the Lord from the west, and his glory from the rising." Excuse me. And is a glory, and is a glory from the rising of the sun, when the enemy shall come in like a flood, right, man, right, man, uh, like a flood. And and what's a flood, happens, you know, is you know, it's kind of, it's kind of sudden, you know, you know, because 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 a flood can, it can it it, it, it can drown you, you know, it, 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 a flood can drown somebody, you know, uh, a, a, a a flood can, it can uh, it can uh, damage things, you know, and it says. The spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him, right, man? So it's gonna come a time when, you know, Esau is, is, is gonna come in like a flood, having great wrath upon us, you know, you know, in, in these last days, and so much that you know the Lord Yahweh Shemal Shai is gonna give his men spiritual power, all right, all right, uh, that standard, all right. Real quickly, just because I read it, let's get the uh, meaning of the word standard in the Blue Letter Bible, all right. Isaiah 59, 19. And Lord's word is less than edifying. Okay. The word standard it says, uh Strong's H fifty one twenty seven. Noose. 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 Okay, and it says to flee, escape. Okay. A, 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 and when I read that, I think about Nightcrawler, you know, from X-Men. You know, like, like, you know, because his spirit, his spiritual ability is to what is to uh, is to teleport, you know, a.k.a. to flee or escape. All right. You know, because in the movies, you know, uh, you know, Nightcrawler, he could be handcuffed by out of nowhere. He, you know, by out of nowhere, he could just, you know, escape from the handcuffs, you know, through his uh, teleportation uh, abilities, you know. And it says uh, to, to take flight. And uh, uh, to, it says to depart, disappear. All right, disappear, man. You know, hey, hey, man. You know, the uh, Yahweh Shnar Shai can make you become invisible. You know, in so much that the troops, 
you know that you know that flood you know uh you know a uh, uh, Esau can't even see you okay and it says to fly right man to uh it says to, uh, to fly man all right meaning what uh, actually fly like neo you know and, and what did it say in isaiah it says that uh, uh they it says that um they shall mount up, they shall mount up with wings as eagles man that's literal that's spiritual power okay so even then so, so even though the lord excuse me so even though esau is gonna, is gonna come in uh, um uh, uh even though esau is gonna come in like a flood having great wrath Okay, how about Shemar Shai in those times are still going to, you know, give his men, you know, uh, those powers, man. Okay, those superhuman abilities. Okay, the, uh, 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 spiritual powers. Okay, and and that's and that's and that's what Esau is trying to stop. Esau do, Esau does not want us to be on top. Esau does not want us to, you know, um, uh, 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 you know, uh, get uh, get our spiritual powers, man. He does not want us to rule. He don't want us to do anything, man. OK, he just wants us to to uh, to stay here in captivity. All right. Serve him. And that's it. OK. He don't want us, you know, to to, to, to serve you. How about Shemar Shai? J just like in ancient Egypt. OK. What did Moses say? He said, let my people go. All right. Esau, Esau is the uh, Esau is the modern day Pharaoh, just like America is just like America is Egypt all over again. The house of bondage. OK. This is Ezekiel 37. I get to the point. Ezekiel 37 and verse 10. And it says, So I prophesied as he commanded me, and the breath came into them, and they lived and stood up and stood up upon their feet, an exceeding great army. Okay, and what's that breath? That breath is the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the scriptures. Ultimately, the Holy Spirit. Okay? And it says, and they lived, right, Ben? Uh, uh, because uh, right now, guess what? We're living while, the, while, while, you know, people out here, you know, our people, two thirds, you know, guess what? You know, they're spiritually dead. All right. They're, uh, uh, they're spiritually asleep. Okay. They're not living right now. They're dead spiritually. Okay. And it says, and the breath of, and the breath came into them and they lived, you know, just like the movie, they live with, with, uh, with, with the rest of, uh, um, Roddy, Roddy Piper, okay, they live, all right, those glasses made him, you know, um, um, uh, those glasses, it made him see, you know, it made him see things, you know, and, you know, and, you know, and, you know, and once he put his glasses on, guess what, he was awake, all right, he was open, okay, all right, it says, and stood up upon their feet, an exceeding great army, right, man, and we're not a carnal army, all right, you know, uh, where is spiritual army? Okay. The house of David. Bayafta would die. All right. The whole full elect, man. Okay. We are a spiritual army. We, we, okay. We, we, not, we, we not out here with, you know, we not out here with, you know, guns and knives and daggers and, and bulletproof vests. No, man. We, we, uh, we have Yahweh Bashim al Shai for that, man, to protect us. Okay. Yahweh Bashim al Shai, all right, uh, 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 is our refuge. Okay. We don't need none of that, man. We have the most high, Yahweh Bashmal Shai. Okay? So we are coming back to you know, our power, Yahweh Bashmal Shai. You know, we are we, we we are standing upon our feet, calling upon the name of Yahweh Bashmal Shai and uh, right in in uh in this captivity. Okay, and we are we are and Jacob is keep waking up, man. We, we are waking up. All right, and Esau can do nothing about it, man. All right, prophecy is, is unraveling day by day. And things are heating up, man. Okay. So with that being said, I just want to say call Lang La. Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, And Laura's as well, this lesson was edifying to the sheep out there. With that being said, Shalom.